Good box out by Mo Walker. Yeah, great job by Mo Walker there. Just allowing them one part, one shot. Well, here comes Buckets already. Just trying to settle into a half-court offense. While he finds a mismatch, finds Spencer Levi. Big man goes up, gets the M1. And he will go the free throw line here for the three-point play. Yeah, nice job. Attacking the baseline. And then left-hand finish, having to go round Mo Walker. Spencer Levi, because he, he's not a high leaper. He's not going to go over the top. Again, a good defense by Mo Walker, making that a very much impossible shot there for Joe Hart. Buckets pulls off from no man. Is that, are you kidding me? As the name implies. 3.06 to go here in the first quarter. Yeah, Holmes, leading scorer for this Riders team, gets in the action early. Well, Green straight off the bench and ice cold in the veins. Copeland trying to use one ball screen. Copeland goes, oh my goodness! This man just went in and took a body with him. Well, no help side defense might take a journey to the land of how to deal with pressure as Copeland just went in and now Plymouth trailing by three. Copeland kicking out, finding Dangakoto. Can tie the game up, three is up, and it's good! Well, what a game we have here at the Plymouth Pavilions. Bowman trying to penetrate, turns it over, now they have numbers. Four on two, what can Plymouth make of this? Green goes in, can't finish, but the follow-up dunk is good. Jacob Wiley just cleaning up. Yeah, for the put, put back, good job by Green, pushing the defense all the way back. Teddy Allen misses the block, and then Wiley says, I'll take that. I'll throw. So he can really focus in on what he does well. Backdoor fighting. TJ Howard goes in with a fang roll. Leading by one point, trying to extend the lead at the moments. Can't leave this man wide open. He'll knock him down and does just that. Oh, Walker's defense making it impossible here for Jacob Wiley. Green another three. This one's up. This time it's good. And now it is a double digit lead to the Plymouth City Patriots. Well, this was a tough, tough three pointer. Terrell Green, I mean, I don't think Kimmel McKenzie could have done anything better. I mean, hand in his face. Saving the ball from going out of bounds, and then Green finished it off perfectly. A little bump in tough move there by TJ Law. Way to use his body inside the paint. Well, here's the first play. There's the bump against Jacob White. I mean, that's a tough play there. Yeah. But again, it's the three-pointer. He catches it, doesn't bring it down. That looks like Jorge Garbajosa winning the FIBA. They push this one. Going all the way now, finds Law in the corner. Oh, went for Jorge Gabajosa. He caught that one at the chest, but Graham, he didn't bring it down. Say to young players, don't bring the ball down when you catch it. That's a hard skill as now Buckets pulls up. <laughs> I'm lost for words with this guy. He is incredible. Gets his own rebound, though. It's not McKenzie. He'll try to fire from downtown. Follow-up is good by Duke Shelton. Ryan is looking to retake the lead. Down the middle. In the air, can't get it, but gets his own rebound. Put back is good by Teddy Buckets. Yeah, nice screen and rescreen at the top with my walk out again. The ball just falls to Allen after he misses the first one, misses with the left, makes it with the right. Well, connection's been made. And Jacob Wiley, not quite the end result the fans wanted, but <laughs> two points will do Paul James very well. Yeah, most important thing, he made the shot, whether it's a dunk or not. Great spacing and getting him behind the D. Nice penetration by Jared Holmes, and again, Plymouth's defense. Patriots looking to tie the game up. Atwood pulling up for mid-range. Mo Walker's hand in his face, but no problem for T.J. Atwood. He misses. Well, that was way too easy to miss. And now Law goes in with the Eurostep, and a solid move there. Ryder staying in that 2-3 zone. Finally playing high-low. Here with Spencer Levi, he's going to isolate himself and just take him Mo Walker inside the paint. Now, interesting, Plymouth attacked that zone defense with the traditional old-school high-low intervention. A D3 by Kimball McKenzie. He's thrown it straight into where Mo Walker's hands were. And we're trying to take out Mo Walker, going all the way. Simply unstoppable. Fortunately, they weren't able to capitalize. That went now. Nice crossover going in. Smooth move by TJ Atwood. Yeah, again, recognizing he's got Walker on him, turns. Quick up fake, crossover, finish. Again, it was an easy penetration, but that's one thing. When he misses those shots, he's always going in for second chances. Now we're under 10 on the shot clock. 
Copeland's been on fire so far, remains on fire. Good six points here in the third quarter. Copeland again, he's a really stylish player. Nice shot. Again, that's unacceptable defense by Plymouth, but even better move by Jared Holmes. Now Plymouth looking to regain the lead. Cam Copeland pulls off a three, and it's good. And it's a two-point lead to the Plymouth City Patriots. Teams getting some good offense, but Graham, the question's been, where's been the defense? Yeah, I mean, but there's some amazing shots being taken, and that is just unreal by TJ Lau off one leg. He wanted the foul, nothing going. That was good defense by Ovisi Dusha, but as you said, a tough shot. It's blessed to come up with a still, it's a four on one. McKenzie's gonna go all the way, finishing under pressure, 407 to go here in the third quarter. We've got it here on the Joe Hoffman mid-range. Time to game ball again. Nice little give and go. That's the minimum that could have happened on that situation. That could have been an extremely violent play. And then that's the next one up and he will be leaving the game. Lava going in. Defense by Terrell Green. Slightly smaller lineup here for Plymouth. Green for no bad slack. Yeah, are you kidding me? Quickest players of Matt Morgan in the league. Yeah, even with the ball, he's he's moving quicker than the guys without. Great job. We're going in looking like George Govin. <laughs> She's trying to penetrate. Finds hard in the corner. Didn't make his last three, but makes this one. Six-point lead to Plymouth. She find a green. Green step back. Huge three-pointer. <laughs> Big time three-pointer. Really sloppy though from from Leicester Riders, but LVC making the most of it. Finding out with down low, no foul call, but again, it's an 11-point ball game. Copeland, Green, Dusha, Joe Hart, and T.J. Abacar on the floor. Green's been on fire, and again, he remains on fire. Biggest lead of the game now. Hey, this one, the roof would definitely have come off the building. So he pulls up for another quick one, and finally gets something to drop. Patriots have got to be careful. Don't just settle for three-point shots. Explore the offense first. Tony Allen going in with a twist and a turn. Got that 14-point lead down to nine. Tony going for a step back. Another three-pointer. Oh, my goodness. Give this man some credit. He has been on an 8-0 run. Could be a big problem here for the Patriots. Allen pulls up for a three-point again. Would you expect any different, Graham? He is unconscious. Yeah, completely in the zone. Dusha trying to penetrate down the baseline. Can't get it. Copeland looking to attack. Again, Buckets just took a gamble there on defense. And down the paint. Buckets doesn't want to pick up that fourth foul. And again, too easy there for Jacob Wiley. Now it's a nine-point game to the Plymouth City Patriots. Just falls over. Oh, we've had numbers. Well, look out below. Here it comes. The alley -oop is up, up and away. Great response by the Patriots. Get it to Wiley above the rim. S swarming defense against Teddy Allen, who turned it over. And look at that. Nothing working here for the Riders. Here we go now. Oh my oh. goodness! Again, a high fly dunk by Jacob Wiley. Wiley Airlines went in. Show any mercy to the defense. <laughs> that is fabulous by Wiley. What a dunk. We'll be getting the offensive rebound. Hey, look at this one. Oh, look out below. Good night. Yeah, that, that's a curtain call right there. It's big time athleticism. Oh, VC going in. No outside defense at the moment. Pulls up, big three. This one's up, no good. A little bit of consolation now for the Riders, but McKenzie finishing quick in transition. She can go to the website of the British Basketball League producer. 27 assists already in this game here for the City Patriots. It's McKenzie now just pulling up from the mid-range. A big victory for these Plymouth City Patriots fans. They've come here, they've cheered all game long. It was a bit of a roller coaster, but at the end of this one, the Plymouth City Patriots win 109 to 93 against the Lesser Riders.